Hey guys, welcome back. As I said, I'm going to use this character for some more presentation and more video. So I hope this video will find you well. So what I want to do is I want to select this both eye. Let's press all Q isolate and I want to create a system that I can control the rotation of the eye individual or both of them but not like this okay so let's get started let's press F and first thing first let's go to uh, spline and create a circle let's create it over here let's make it just a bit uh, bigger press shift A and select this eye so we will have it in the middle now actually we can make it smaller scale it down okay great now let's press shift and duplicate again shift a and we have two circles let's select all this select eyes and let's bring this circle in front Okay, so I think it's a decent uh, distance. Um, we can also reduce maybe the size radius. Let's set it to 3. Because I've scaled them, let's select all of them and reset X form, right click convert to editor poly okay great so now let's um, let's isolate them so we can work with them let's select this one press shift and move it over here and then let's scale it and let's make it like this again let's reset poly okay cool so now that we have this system let's select again eyes isolate them isolate them and then uh, before everything I want to go and select let's select this one and press alt right click and freeze transform so you have a pop-up you can read this and then press yes so what i did is let's uh, select this one and move it here if i want this uh, spline to go back where it was i just need to go to alt right click and transform to zero and as you can see it's set where it was initial place so what I want to do next is I want to link this uh, two to this big controller. So let's go to select link, left click and drag it. And once again, left click and drag it. Uh, I will rename this. So let's rename, pff, I don't know, I. Zero two and this one I zero one and then let's call it big controller. I will encourage to find better name <laughs> anyway. And now let's go back and select these two, actually these three, and press again Alt right click and freeze transform so to make sure that everywhere everything will be in place again so press alt right click and transform to zero let's test this out so alt right click transform to zero okay great so let's go and select i let's go to group open and let's call this 
Plera zero one inside Cornea zero one Clara zero two and Cornea zero two. Um, I can use this link, but I'm going to go to schematic and then as you can see we have our group and if we, we select Cornea we can move it as you can see so let's unite Cornea 2 to Sclera 2 so connect left click and then let's unite Cornea 1 to Sclera 1 great we can close this schematic and as you can see if we select Sclera, we're going to move both of them. Awesome. So next step, let's go to and select Sclera, animation, constraint, and look at constraint. Let's go and select I2. And as you can see, we have a blue line that uh, shows us the path, but the transport pivot is modified. So let's uh, check this keep initial offset. Let's go back and select this animation constraint look at constraint and once again keep initial offset. Now we can close these groups and if we select this controller as you can see we can move our eye with alt click right transform to zero I will set back in place let's move them like this alt right click transform to zero perfect let's go from isolate mode let's press F4 and let's get close to our character because I want to see better the controllers I'm going to select let's select the big one and just enable in viewport depending the size you can adjust it and then let's select the other one enable to viewport and the last one as you can see i can barely see it enable in viewport i won't enable the render because i do not want to show that in render another good part we can change color let's change it to green this one uh, we can leave it this one like this and this one let's change it to bluish okay cool so now I can move them around we can press let's select both alt transform to zero and let's move the big one so it's so cool i love it uh, i hope you enjoyed this video if you do subscribe share and leave a comment see you next time take care